Mars at opposition, a lunar eclipse, and April's Lyrid meteor shower. Hello and welcome. I'm Jane Houston Jones from NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory in Pasadena, California. On April 8, Mars reaches opposition in its nearly two year orbit when it's directly opposite the Sun in our sky. This year, Mars will be closer to Earth than it has been since 2007. Mars rises in the east in the early evening and is visible all night long. The viewing will be best a little after midnight when the red planet reaches its highest elevation. Some of the famous dark markings and possibly the polar cap will be visible, even in a small telescope. The next Mars oppositions happen in 2016 and 2018 when Mars will be even closer to the Earth and will appear even more impressive in the telescope. Mars spacecraft launches always happen roughly two years apart, a few months before opposition. Because both Earth and Mars are moving in space, we don't aim our spacecraft at where Mars is at launch. Instead, our spacecraft's elliptical orbit takes it to where Mars will be at the end of its seven or eight month journey. InSight, NASA's next Mars mission, launches in 2016 to study the deep interior of Mars and help understand the processes that shaped the rocky planets of the inner solar system more than four billion years ago, including Earth. By using sophisticated geophysical instruments, InSight will measure the planet's vital signs, its pulse, temperature, and reflexes. The Dawn mission's two targets